Well, Matthias, what did you think of today's performance? Um, I think it wasn't our best performance. I think we did better against Birmingham. Uh, I know it was a different game and a different place to to play, but uh, I think first half was uh, was not very good from our side. Uh, we were a lot under pressure, um, and we were not clever enough to 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 make the longer passes. We played short all the time, and that's what they wanted. Um, but uh, it was uh, it was nil nil in the half, and uh, we came out much stronger in the second half. And uh, we got uh, a goal after like 10 minutes, 10 minutes or something. Um, and from there on, I don't think they had like big chances. They had one maybe, um, but I think we were stronger in the second half. What was Thomas's message at, at, at half time? What what changed in that in that half time break? Just that we were still in the game. I mean, uh, everybody was a bit down with the head because uh, we knew we played a, a very bad first half. Um, I think Middlesbrough did very well, um, but we were a lot under pressure, and uh, luckily we were still in the game. Um, so we just kept believing, and uh, of course we we got the goal, which. Uh, made us believe uh, even more uh, and luckily we got the win. You say the players were a little bit down at half time, does that show the standards that, that you demand of each other that, that that was the feeling? Yeah, I mean even though we, we played uh, very bad in the first half, we still have uh, I think a strong defence. Um, I've heard that it wasn't that strong last year, there was problems so we've been working a lot in the preseason with that um, and as you can see even though we were not on pressure we still kept the clean sheet. And that last half hour, you you seen yourself and Josh seem to get on the ball a lot, and we were able to dictate that last half hour quite well. Yeah, I mean, of course, it uh, it gets easier uh, uh, during the during the game uh, as the minute minutes goes. Um, they were, of course, they had a lot of energy in the beginning, and you can see that we didn't get a lot of time on the ball, um, and that's what I meant to be clever to to put the balls uh, deeper in some times, but. Uh, but yeah, we got uh, more space during the game. Uh, you can see they, they got tired and we uh, we kept the ball much more. You've now had two tastes of, of championship football. What, what are your early impressions of it? Uh, it's great. Uh, it's great to, to play the games. Uh, I mean, the atmosphere out there is, uh, is amazing uh, and even better when you get the win. And obviously, you, you spoke when you joined about your frustrating year last year of not playing much football, really keen to kick on and, and, and play game after game this year. Yeah, hopefully uh, I can stay uh, stay on the pitch and don't be injured again. Um, <clears throat> that's what I wanted, and that's why I went here to Brentford. Uh, I mean, it's a, it's a fantastic club so far. Uh, it's my feeling, so uh, so I can't wait to to play more games. And obviously, you've got Christian, Camo, and, and now Drew will come to the squad as well. So in that in that midfield area, there's a, a lot of competition. Yeah, no. Um, I mean, right now we don't have that many. I mean, uh, Camo just went back from the from the Africa Cup of Nations and Chris has been injured the last uh, week or two um, and then uh, obviously uh, Drew came on uh, this week so uh, so it's the right time for me to, to show my quality and uh, I'm trying to do everything.